Hi guys, my name's Jim and welcome to Six String Studies. Now today we're going to be looking at what do we do when we want to go beyond the minor pentatonic for uh, soloing. So you might be stuck in that position one box and you might want to add a bit more flavour to it and that involves learning a few more scales. Now this is especially for you Spencer, I hope you get some use out of it, study it hard. We're going to be looking at some alternative minor scales, um, natural minor, Phrygian, Dorian and harmonic minor. So let's get to the lesson. Okay, so moving beyond the minor pentatonic scale. So we're looking at the root position minor pentatonic scale in A. So A minor pentatonic. So to go beyond the minor pentatonic scale, we're going to add two more notes in. We're going to add the note B on the seventh fret of the E string. We're going to keep using the note C, D, E, and then we're going to use an F sharp, okay, which is on the fourth fret of the D string. So we have this so far. We're going to play through the minor pentatonic still, so we have this now. We're going to add 5 and 7 as we normally would on the D string. Okay, we're going to do 4, 5 and 7 on the G string. That's still that B note there. 5, 7 and 8 on the B string. And five, seven, eight on the E string. This is an A Dorian scale. Sounds like this. And the chord that we're going to use against this is an A minor seven chord, and you should see the chord somewhere here. So just by adding two more notes in, we can get a lot more choice in our playing. Okay, the next one we're going to be doing is an A Phrygian scale. It sounds like this. This is going to be played against an A minor 7 flat 9 chord. Okay. Um, this is quite a dark sounding mode, it's the third mode of the F major scale. So it's still A minor, but we're really coming from an F major scale there. So we're adding the 6th fret on the E string, and we're going to add again the 8th fret on the A string. And we're just going to repeat that in the next octave. There we go.
OK, the next scale is an A Aeolian scale. Sounds like this. This is also known as the natural minor scale, so we're doing an A Aeolian scale. All we're doing here is adding the eighth fret on the, uh, sorry, adding the seventh fret on the E string. I'm going to add the eighth fret again on the A string. Otherwise, nothing has changed from the from the uh, the minor pentatonic. We're just adding in two notes and going through the octave. And that's going to be used against an A minor 7 sharp 5 chord. OK, the last one we're going to be looking at is the A harmonic minor scale. It sounds like this, so if you want something a little bit more out there, this is a cool one to do it with. And again, all we're doing here is adding the 7th fret on the E string. 8th fret on the A string. Now this 5th fret here on the D has been moved to the 6th fret. This is a major 7. And then just continuing through. Watch for that big spread there. And this is going to be played against an A minor major 7 chord. So there you go guys, I hope you enjoyed that lesson. If you did, let me know in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe and check out Six String Studies book one, two and three if you want to learn more about these scales. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.